Yeah, we're going to lock down. Well, I think in a great amount of time, we just got to call back to tell us how good everything was. We also have a discussion that we're gonna do. Ooh, that Pepsi is delicious. Because y'all ain't had a Pepsi in so long. I feel like I'm cheating on somebody. Thank all of you for coming in today and happy, happy, happy morning. It should be Thursday. <laughs> uh, before we get started, y'all, please like this video, subscribe to my channel, hit that bell so you have notifications every time that we post. Please share, share, share with everyone so my channel can continue to grow. Um, also, comment down below some of the topics that we speak on or some of the questions that we may ask you. Then go over to Tyra's channel, do the exact same for her Tyra's Big World of Flavor. Hey, this is Tyra's Big Flavor. And do the exact for her. And it's your brain lady. I'm wearing my braids. Getting ready to eat Taco Bell. I have hard and soft tacos. And I have them as my Supremes. <laughs> Alright, yes, yeah, so I'm going to be quiet for a minute while I'm tired of her. Ooh, yes. Oh, wow. This is the best looking one I've had ever. Yeah, my thumbnail is going to be horrible. Because my stuff, I'm in the car and it's in the bag. Father, in the name of Jesus, Lord, thank you for this food. Thank you for the roof over our head. Close our back and feed at your table, God. Thank you for everything you have done for us, God. And please bless this food that we are about to receive. In your name that we pray. Amen. Amen. But like I said, I have supreme tacos. I have one hard and the rest, but I have two hard, I think. And, I, and the rest soft. I was supposed to have three softs or whatever. But I didn't hear her say soft, so I told her she could keep one of mine. I just, oh. Uh, but y'all, we do have on our chef coats. Because it's the same day that we did our deliveries. Yes. So, that's why I we have a Mexican pizza with... Tacos. But yes, um, we both did a video. On, how y'all doing? How are y'all doing? We both did a video on delivering. Well, the well, we both did a video on preparing. Our, yeah, preparing. I think. The plate. Oh, I probably have to connect mine to this because it's not that long. Sure, it's a napkin. That's true. Yeah, I am not using yeah, my I'm mouth. Yeah, I am so hungry. I'm not using my mouth. I'm listening. Even though it's so tempting to use my mouth to open it because it's so much easier. But I do understand. I can't be preaching about everybody else not being safe about the um about this virus going around if I'm not being safe. Yes! I gotta practice what I preach. Preach, brother! Come on, better. Uh-uh. I'm gonna get you a sock the little white girl. Oh. Woo! You didn't say it like her, so that's why I didn't know. I haven't watched that movie in so long. Hmm? Huh? I haven't watched that movie in so long. Yeah, we got a lot done. Well, I think in a great amount of time, we just got a call back to tell us how good everything was. Hey, um, 
We also have the special that we want to do. Ooh, that Pepsi is delicious. Because y'all ain't had a Pepsi in so long. I feel like I'm cheating on somebody. Mm. There's a gift cut y'all at me. But, because we were discussing our topic and I was like, wait, save it for the video. Oh, I want to talk about, what is it? Cele cele celebrity boot camp. And I marriage had this discussion. Hip -hop edition. Yeah, marriage book camp. It ain't marriage. Yes, it is. I thought a celebrity book camp. No. Huh. Why is it marriage? And ain't, no, ain't nobody on their marriage. Willie and. They don't want to run. But I guess they said they And um, corrupt. Are you married? They're not married. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Is that his girlfriend? I think so. She's his girlfriend doing all that for him? Mm -hmm, I think so. Oh, she is too good. Y'all correct me if I'm wrong. But she I think is too good. All that stuff he's putting her through and she's just his girlfriend? Oh, ma'am. But I have this discussion with y'all. Dr. B, I'm using my, um, my table. Um... Now remember me telling y'all that everybody just need to keep their hands to themselves. Yes, it is super wrong for a man to hit a woman because the strength of a man is like running into a brick wall. Now you got some little soft ones out there. Yeah. But still, it is wrong. But we can't just. The thing is. What you got? Reflex. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But we can't just blame or make one side feel like they're completely guilty and not make the other side, you know, see where they were wrong. I'm not saying, like, you know, degrade her or anything, but, like, I always said she was wrong for what she did. That's what I said. I mean... There comes a point, especially when he's holding both on. of them wrong. Yes, for, for want to um, result to um, violence. Yes, but there comes a point in anyone. I don't care what gender you are, especially if you're holding in your emotions and your feelings, you're going to explode. I'm not saying that's an excuse, but if you're holding in that much anger, that much built-up tension, yep. you're going to explode. And y'all hear how she pronounced that T? <laughs> and that's just. I think that's what happened because he was already mad. Well, first he was mad because of she was blaming him for um, shocking him wrong. When he was shocking her because she was that doing was the things assignment. Wrong. Yes, that was the assignment. And he, she was, sh he was shocking her because he was completing the assignment and she was getting mad and refused to do it. So he was mad about that because he was also she was also embarrassing him by yelling and stuff. Then once they got in the house. He got mad again because she kept going and then she threw those hard apples. Apples. Two apples on two. him. Two apples. So he sat there and he took it. Yes. The embarrassment and maybe the hurt because I'm sure they hurt. And again, we are not saying that that was right for him to put his no, hands on no. her. No, no. He shouldn't have. He shouldn't have um, jack up. He shouldn't have. Yeah, but man, and she shouldn't have hit him. Yes. And kept talking her trash, talking trash, and hit him. To me, it was the same crime. Me, yeah. personally. And I'm Dr. Sorry. Ish, I don't understand. You're Dr. supposed Ish to be a and the lady. What's yeah. her name? Judge Toller. Yeah. Y'all are supposed to be encouraging and telling them what they did wrong. Yep. But you're making her feel like she did nothing, nothing wrong. wrong. Mm -hmm. I know y'all say that nothing can result um, is an excuse for a man to put his hands on you. I'm sorry, but there is. People have anger. They are humans. Nobody, that why nobody should put their hands on nobody. You either. I don't care how angry somebody make you and you that built up, you better walk away. If somebody threw two apples at me, I'm getting up and fighting them. <sighs> Honestly, like, what would you do? I don't know. For one, if they were steady talking, and I know I'm getting fed up, I ain't gonna be there for no apple to be thrown because I don't walk away. Me personally. I don't walk all the way away. Don't get it over there. 
Where'd it go? I'm gonna move down in there because you ain't trying to grab it. See, that was a bug. See, me, my thing is, that's why I pay stuff attention. And you can see when stuff about to go left. If I see it's about to go left, I know I don't want to fight. I know I don't want nobody touching me. I'm walking away. Because why sit there and wait for something you see about to happen? Because he was trying to resolve the issue with her. This is Mary's boot camp. So he's trying to sit there, resolve, talk to her about it. But she's so in denial that she's not trying to listen to him. He's trying to tell her, I was shocking you because you did what I, what I was supposed to shock you for. She kept saying that he was shocking her out of spite. No. He was shocking you because you were doing what you did wrong. And then once they got there, like I can see because when it led to it, what she was saying is she was basically blaming it all on him, saying he was trying to make her look like the bad guy. Again, must I repeat, we are not saying it was right. But if we look at human beings and human being reactions, taking out gender, taking out gender, what would pe those human beings' reaction be? First off, I ain't gonna keep talking to you. I'm gonna let you keep talking. Just get, just do what you do. Now, if you hit me because I'm ignoring you, then that's a bigger issue. Because if I'm gonna let you talk just to hear yourself and let you embarrass yourself, that's you. He knew where it was going. Yeah, he knew that he wanted to do something to her. Because in the confessional room, he said somebody's going to get hurt from her or something. He knew that he was getting ready to do something. So he probably should I ain't saying that. I'm saying. No, I'm saying because in the confessional, he literally said somebody's going to get hurt tonight. He said that. Or he said somebody's going to get hurt or he's going to fight somebody. Something like that. He said that in the confessionals right after she threw those apples at oh, him. I didn't hear that. He said that, and that means that when he was going into that room, he was already built up for anger, and he knew he was going to do something. So maybe if he would have sat by somebody else or something, I don't know. That was just a very surprising situation mm -hmm. because everybody else, nobody else reacted. And I'm pretty sure if it was another circumstance, a lot of men would have jumped out and probably fought But him. see, that's why I grew up making them comments like you making right now. About the other girl. About what? Mess around and throw a ball and hit me in the face. And you're making little subliminal comments. You know, because he want to get out of the house anyhow. About the girl, the tiny looking girl. Mm -hmm. He trying to say that she dangerous. And she he can't be around her. And he said... Oh. He said, right when I hit her back, you're going to throw me out. I lock me up because I'm a man. That's ooh, sucks. Well, he's saying that because of what has already happened in the house. Yeah. But I don't think the girl was going to hurt him. I don't know. She looked like she was, though. Yeah. She looked like she was going to hurt him good. Not hurt him bad. Hurt him real good. She was angry at him. I would be too. Especially if they're not married. I would be mad. I done been here with you this long and you still haven't given me a ring? Putting up with this? Oh, sir. But, me personally, I wouldn't result in the choking of someone. Like, honestly, my thing is, a lot of stuff can be avoided. You see stuff. You see the direction of something's going. The That's security the people saw the direction. The producer saw the direction everything was going. They didn't try to protect them from each other. They didn't even pull her off when she threw those apples, did they? No, for sure. I'm done. The producers... Okay, now that now it comes to this case. They knew that he... he they could see by his facial expressions that he was angry. They didn't try to remove him from the group or remove him from her. 
No, because he never had that reaction, I think they said. Mm -hmm. So they wasn't expecting it. Just like she says, she wasn't expecting that. Yeah, I wasn't expecting it either. Yeah, she said he never been like that. Never. It was just probably, I'm not giving him an excuse. It was just probably very embarrassed. You know? Because men. And then they didn't kick out, um, um, what's the name? Boyfriend. Yeah. And he did the same thing. But he didn't um, grab her. Yes, he did. No, he just snatched the phone yeah, from Yeah, he snatched the phone. But men are very sensitive when it comes to being made a fool of. You know, uh -uh. Ooh, excuse like me. if a woman is disrespecting them or something, they think that the woman is acting like they're soft or something. You know, like, you know what I'm trying to say? No. And then, I don't know. Never mind. Ego. Yeah. That's what you're trying to say. At the end of the day, both of them are wrong. Yep. Both and I don't think are. it was handled. How they handled him, it should have did the same to her, in my opinion. My opinion, both of them should have been handled the same because it was the same issues taken on both of their behalf. Me personally. That's what I think. Now, I don't agree with the man putting his hands on a woman. No, I don't agree. Yeah, I don't agree with that. We don't we're not we're not saying that that's right. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. And I heard that um Tammy Roman was speaking on it. And she spoke on it after I was talking to y'all about it. Men and she pretty much <clears throat> said the same thing I said. Said it to you. Yeah. I'm talking about because I had already talked about it. But no one ever gives like men awareness or like domestic violence oh. things. You know? Like what if a woman is abusing a man? It's happened. Yeah, but they don't do they do the same thing that they do for women? I know most men don't come out mm -hmm. about the abuse that they go through. Because what I was talking about. Ego. Yeah. 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 But I know some cases where there's abuse. And if a police come out to your house, he'll assess the situation. And if you see no harm is done to the female, but harm is done to the male, he would take the the, the female in. Mm. Yeah, I've seen that. I've seen that on so, several of the um, the police shows. And I ain't talking about law and order. I'm not saying that she's abusing him. I'm just saying in general. I mean, there are different forms of abuse. Yeah. Verbal. To me, hurts just as much as physical. Because you're messing with your mental. Mm -hmm. My opinion. But my, my thing to you will. Wasn't it? Why wasn't it? I don't understand. I mean, I do understand because a woman, like you said, a man's power, like of a hit, is much stronger or something. Mm -hmm. But why didn't they take that, like, that major effect in as soon as she threw those apples? You know? Like, why was it just dusted off? Because, like I said, he never did that before. I'm thinking he never did that before. I said apples. I'm uh -huh. talking about her. I know you're talking about. He never did it. They didn't expect him to behave, but uh, react. I'm not talking about that. I know. You said, why didn't they come in and take him away, right? No. I'm talking about take her away. Like, before they even sat down in that, like, when he choked her. Why didn't they take her away as soon as she threw those apples? Because she's a star. Like, she's a celebrity. They said they want zero violence in the house. The celebrities in the house are corrupt. Tahiri, Phaedra, Willie, and E. They're the people Hazel. they yep, the people they with are the guests. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. That's how I see it. I could be wrong. But that's how I see it. So because she the celebrity, 
they looked at her and treated her as such. That's what I think. And like how they were doing in the house, like he had his problems with his baby mama, you know, still having like an emotional attachment, mm -hmm. attachment to her. And then his issue with her was that she wasn't showing him the same affection in her past relationship. Not putting forth effort, he felt. Mm -hmm. And she felt like he felt like she disrespected him a lot. Mm hmm Didn't Talk like, with him like he was a kid. Mm hmm Tried to be his mother, mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. But she said that he didn't communicate. A lot of men don't. They just keep their feelings. She said she don't. said the most he's talking when he got in the house. Maybe he's he felt he needed a mediator. There's no need for him saying that because he wasn't gonna be heard anyhow because she treated him like a child. That mm -hmm. could be how he felt. Yeah. But a man isn't gonna say that. It's gonna True. keep being quiet. Yep. And that's why I think the issue is too. He need he needed to speak up and say something. Because when you keep feelings inside for that long, he probably think his name you see what his name stood for? What does it stand for? Uh, what his name is? Bado. Okay. Um, what is it? Violence. On something. Something only. Something. I don't know if it's violence. Only. I don't know. Something. Something ain't positive. Good dealing with thug life. I can tell you that. That's what that was. Now. So therefore, he didn't probably didn't react. Cause he be seeming like, like they were called a, a female dog. Maybe, yeah, that's what I was thinking. Like that's why I was when I was saying about the ego thing. Mm -hmm. I, that's the word I was. That's I why was, they don't. Yeah, you can't say that word. I know. That's why a lot of men don't say nothing because they will be portrayed as a female dog. And I was saying because when she threw them apples at him and how she was talking to him, he f probably felt like she was treating like sh like she was treating him like a female dog. Like like he was she was trying to make him out as a female dog. I feel like th that's what a man excuse me would think mm -hmm. because of how big their ego is, you know? Well, not so much they think they think they'll be portrayed yeah as such by other men. Mhm. Mm they ain't too much worry about what a woman think. They think about what the fellas gonna think and how they gonna stand up, uh, you know, hold their ground if they portrayed as a female dog. That's what I think. You know, that that just me. Do I think that they could work it out? Honestly, I wouldn't take them back. I wouldn't take neither one of them back because it's not a safe environment for neither. Because for one, will they be over what happened or will they keep bringing it up? I don't think anybody would be over what happened. I definitely wouldn't. Yeah, that trust would be something that you're gonna have to build back yeah, up. Yeah, because now you gotta look out for both. Yeah, like you gonna throw something at me? Yeah, you gonna choke me? And I'm just talking to you, thinking I'm communicating, and you taking it as me starting something and not listening. So, yeah, they need a break. Yeah. But at the end of the day, I you guess know. you say, that's all right. I got me a good hotel room with a kitchen. As long as y'all still run me my check. Yeah. As long as you still run me my check, we good. Because I ain't going home. I just don't like how Dr. Ish and Judge told her. You know, yeah. Her. You know. But I think that they should, I know y'all are trying to see how stable she is and how she's doing. But also, you know, pull her to the side and try to talk to her about. And I'm going to pull her to the side and say it on camera. Because yeah. some women need to hear that. It's not your fault. It's not all your fault, honestly. Not all her fault, because both of them were heated. Mm -hmm. So it's both of their issues. But it's not all her fault that yeah. he hit her. But, but it is some of your fault because you hit him in the face of two apples. Yeah, and now was that, that right? That what they should ask her. Was that right? 
and the fact that they're all trying to just put it on him and then when she was saying um like when he was asking her what what had happened and how she was saying that she could have been wrong and then dr ish said no nothing you could have done mm -hmm. nothing you did result should result in a man hitting you or whatever that's not true i don't agree that is with that. not true i'm sorry yeah I, so I mean, sorry. if you provoke anything, if you provoke a little dog too much, the dog is going to end up growling and trying to fight you. That's true. Like, if you provoke anyone or if you just do something to anyone, they're going to react. And you can't, like, some people can't control their reactions, you know? Not saying that's a good thing, but Dang. some people just can't control their reactions. And they don't need to be around people they can't control their actions. Yeah. Because everybody got control of them and what they do. But like you said, they said that he had never been like that before. So that reaction probably was brand new to him too. He was just so built up with anger. Then in a house full of other couples who were probably looking at them him a certain kind of way. Then what you said about him trying to hold up his image to other guys. Mm -hmm. He's probably just so angry, embarrassed. I'm not trying to give him an excuse. I'm just saying like how his reaction could have, you know... But like, I'm trying to think about like how he was thinking during that time, you know. And this, then she was probably just gonna follow him forever. Yeah, she, he's gonna always be known for that. And she, if he didn't do it, if he did it, he would have been known for it because of what she did to him. But I could see like the scared. Like I feel like she was so embarrassed. I would have been too. And she was just so scared because it was just like wow. She was just like taken back from it. I would have been changed. Yeah, she, that's why she said, I don't know how to react. That was just so much for her. And I, I do think, I think, like I said, I think both of them were wrong. I think, I do feel bad that she had to go through that. But I'm not going to sit here at like either one of them are the victim. Because both of them were wrong. Exactly. All right, y'all. Well, I'm about to get out of here. But y'all comment down below what y'all think about it. And, um, like this video subscribe to my channel hit that bell to get notifications every time that we post please share 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 with everyone go over to tyra's channel and do the same for her also look in that description box and purchase some of her merch go to amazon purchase her books and also join her channel and why 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 not control you because you have control of you love y'all